Hi, my name is George. I work in the computing faculty in the Glasgow Clyde College. I teach different um, courses like cybersecurity and esports. Hi, I'm Ryan. Uh, I also work in the computing department in the college. Uh, I teach esports, uh, software development, and a bit of cybersecurity as well. Um, a lot of people still really can't really tell us what esports is, which of course esports does stand for electronic sports. It's taking online gaming to the point where we're making it a spectator sport, like football and other types of uh, published sports already, um, but it opens gaming up to a massive platform. What initially sparked my interest in teaching um, esports in the college? I've um, been gaming since the 1990s. Um, so for me it's just a, it's a passion at home and now it's been an, an excellent chance to have that to be able to teach a passion like this inside the college. What initially sparked my interest in teaching this course, uh, being a lifetime gamer myself, uh, from the PlayStation 1 to building my own PC, uh, I've always been really enjoying getting immersed in the different worlds and challenging my skills uh, playing these different games. And when the course uh, came up uh, on offer, it felt like a perfect time to share this passion with the students and help create a community and build that safe learning environment. Uh, my favourite part of the teaching the course as well has been seeing the students kind of come out their shells and work together, uh, playing the games. Um, the content itself, um, we're getting to cover all sorts of different games. Um, but we're also going into kind of deeper things in gaming as well, whether it be health and well-being, um, but also covering game strategy. So it, it's a really kind of engaging type of course. Uh, other skills as well that the students will be kind of developing and learning about, uh, from like broadcasting and creating their own brand as an esports player, uh, creating social media channels so they can uh, stream their content out to the world. Teaching the course this year has been really good as well, getting involved with the student champs and getting the students to kind of see what esports is like in real life as well. And we were one of the first colleges in Scotland actually from 2022 to actually take part in the championships. So already um, we've been leading the way that way, just in the way of esports and tournaments. And other ways that we're trying to differentiate and like expand on our current course is creating pathways for the different students. So starting at level five and building them up uh, to level six, and then giving them opportunities to progress into our other courses later on. But it could be some um, kind of students that want to be just professional gamers. Um, it can be going on to sports coaching again, esports coaching online. Um, it can also transfer over to shoutcasting, uh, broadcasting, and streaming. And there's there's just loads of other areas that it can expand to. Some of the uh, challenges that we've faced is sometimes it can be a bit of a toxic environment. So it's try to build the students up and cover like their health and well-being and making sure that everybody feels safe and uh, is confident in joining games and taking part. Um, an interest in esports or gaming, you don't have to be a skilled gamer because um, again you'll learn that on the course with us um, but having an interest in esports and gaming but also um, maybe just even an enthusiasm to also take, know you're going to be taking part as well or want to take part. So if you're coming to join us, uh, you're going to be working in teams, uh, you're going to be playing games, entering tournaments uh, on a national level uh, with the student champs and you'll be also broadcasting and streaming and putting content together. Can't, Can't wait to see you in August. August. <laughs>